the Rays if they don't finish this little mini comeback here be thinking about that fourth inning first yeah. and third nobody out and they fail to score Muncie takes a ball it will pop up by Wendell a strikeout of Adamas and then caught stealing Margot. It's about the third at bat where Muncie gets a little more aggressive than he does early. He's seen every pitch that he can throw. One ball, one strike. Hit a rocket into the right field corner his last time up. He's been on base twice. You know what's amazing about Max Muncie, and I'm sure it's happened, we don't watch every game. I can't remember too many times seeing him ever break his bat. And that's a credit to him not expanding the zone and not getting caught off balance. But there's a 2 1. Oh. Do you know when the last unsuccessful steal of home attempt happened in World Series play? I had um, if you're asking me I had to be there you were there you were on the mound three balls and a strike Muncie fouls it away game four. the twin Shane Mack in ninety one in the fourth inning really really you tried to steal home are you questioning no I'm just questioning my stats my department. ability to remember and the whole crew there you go there look at that. The whole crew at Sports Radar. Huh. I mean, you were there. Here's a high fly ball into right, absolutely belted. Muncie points at his dugout and will take the trot. Dodgers lead four to two here in the fifth. Two, three, and four in the Dodgers lineup is sizzling the last three games. I mean, on fire. For Muncie, that is his third postseason home run this year, his first World Series home run. And the Dodgers now set a record with nine different players with a home run. And we're only in game five. Renfro didn't even move out and right. For all you young broadcasters out there, when an outfielder doesn't move, good chance it's a home run. 